great scientific value it offers. Fantastic talks, fantastic presentation. Quite interesting conference. I'm very impressed. It's a five-star meeting. Centers. There is a Korean translation. With 300 Korean medicine doctors and about 50 Western medical doctors. Traditional medicine has its own benefit and also conventional medicine have its advantages in the different fields. But uh, each of these medical systems have their own limitations. So I think integral medicine is the best way for patients and healthcare. From this patient had more uh, specific region of pain, I will focus on that muscle. So we have a lot of people with chronification and we have also a growing elderly population and both these two groups are they have to expect to use a lot of painkillers during their lives. So as you probably know, we have the opioid crisis in the U.S. because of too many painkillers. So I think that the non-pharmacological treatments can reduce the amount of uh, painkillers. Here is the an effective treatment. I think just then uh, starting the clinical practice uh, in hospital, but later on they have developed both research and facilities to help advancing the clinical practice. So by uh, holding the conference, it can be shared with this experience and also research advances uh, with other participants from the different countries. So we can share the development and also share the information and experience. This morning, there were several talks about uh, randomized trials, systematic reviews and meta-analysis. So I think that's good. I'm very impressed with the level of research here. So I think as far as I saw yesterday, you're using different methods like for example we saw using ultrasound when he put the needle and the pharmacopuncture into the body. And I think we have to need things from both sides of the medicine. So ultrasound is very good when you want to hit the core of the root problem. So I think that's very good. Hey, also, um Visiting the hospital and the pharmacy, I can really see the high level everything works on and the hospital can really inform other approaches to build an inter integrative medicine facility and to really be taken as a blueprint. So it's, it's really a, a great thing that has been developed there. I think uh, Jason's model seems to be uh, very interesting and uh, very very useful for many countries to follow and many or at least many institutions to follow who can who has the resources and also has the technology and skill available with them to utilize that properly so how to integrate it? both conventional therapy and uh, korean traditional medicine is a key issue I think to be able to integrate a specific treatment or also a whole medical system into healthcare, we definitely need robust evidence. And I think what we need to do is actually, we, do, we need to do a lot more systematic reviews. So uh, this will be a, a good platform uh, for developed further research and collaboration, I believe so. In general, but also in the field of precision medicine.